youth violence and school threats. 71 school threats investigated take hours and hours and multiple detectives to do on each occasion. Omaha Police Chief Todd Schmader sharing the latest data at the 11th Annual Violence Prevention and Justice Summit. The chief says since the school mass shooting in Florida, there have been 71 threats reported to Omaha police, leading to 10 arrests, two placed in emergency protective custody, and three who voluntarily entered counseling. There was probably some things that should have been called in a long time ago, and we're getting an opportunity now to come back and address that. And while praising his school resource officers and staff, Schmader shares ideas for solutions. He says school shootings should be considered a national emergency and that every city should have a robust threat assessment team. The chief also wants to relax standards so law enforcement could more easily take someone's gun if that person is a threat. Finally, Schmader believes in local control of schools. But I do think that there should be a national requirement that every school has to do a safety condition assessment and take some ownership of their, of their safety all across the line. City and county officials, as well as area organizations, paying attention. In recent light of the number of school shootings and things of that nature and the violence in and around the Omaha area and nationwide, um, we try to teach our young people that they're the leaders. Leadership and teamwork with the goal of reducing violence. I'm hoping that my young people will walk away with a sense of purpose. In Omaha, Chin Doan, KETV, Newswatch 7.